Simple forming of sheet metal in a punch press has been around for many years, but complex forms such as a hinge can be processed too. With today's machine technology, specifically punch presses with stroke control, hinges no longer need to be a headache to produce. Forming a successful hinge in a punch press is typically a three-step process that uses two forming tools, tool 1 and tool 2, also known as the knuckle tool. After the tabs have been punched in the sheet to be formed, tool number 1 is used to make the first two forming strokes. The first stroke produces the leading edge of the tab that slides around the interior of the second tool during the final operation. The second forming stroke with tool 1 bends the tabs up to a designed angle, typically between 75 and 88 degrees. The third and final forming stroke uses tool number 2, the knuckle tool. As the knuckle tool lowers down to the sheet metal tab, the raised tab enters the upper tool, making contact near the front edge. As the tool continues to descend, the tab is forced to slide around the perimeter of the upper tool, curling it around to form a hinge. Let your punch press do the work for you. Create hinges directly on the parts that use them while eliminating secondary operations, such as spot welding or riveting in place. Forming hinges in a punch press ensures accuracy over secondary operations and can also eliminate the cost of specialized press brake or stamping tooling to create hinge forms in a secondary operation. To learn more about hinge tools or other forming applications, call MATE, the special applications experts. MATE continues to accelerate deliveries of special applications to keep you up and running smoothly. Plus, MATE has many common application tooling systems available for same-day shipment. So call MATE now, 763-421-0230.